Hey everybody, welcome back to The Dude's Kitchen. I'm your man, The Dude, and if it's your first time here, please remember to subscribe and ring that bell for notifications. Today we're doing hot wings. I know, hot wings, everybody does them. Millions of different ways to do hot wings. I, I'm in there with them. I, this is just one of the ways that I do hot wings, right? If you want to see really good hot wings though, there, like I said, everybody does them. There's some good channels out there doing My buddy Craig over behind the garage barbecue makes them and this is kind of inspired by him. I don't have that really cool rotisserie he has, but I do have these. We're making hot wings with them. These are kind of like big old wings too, man. Liking that. All right, first thing we want to do is we want to put some EVOO on these. And I'm just going to use, put some EVOO onto this pan that we're going to use later. Let's throw them in there. Get them all EVOO'd up. And that'll help the skin become a little bit more crisp. It'll act as a binder to hold our Uncle Steve's bird powder onto it. Let's grab the Uncle Steve's. All right, I got some Uncle Steve's bird powder. These all flatten out. Give them a good coat, man. Serious, good coat. This stuff rocks. That's all we need for that. So now we're gonna just take our wing, and just kinda put it in like so, right? Couple wings. And normally we'd use this for like a whole chicken, you know, rotisserie for the whole chicken. Kinda goes around. But you know what? This works perfect for wings too. Voila. Put on it like so. Tighten it up. The other one on like so. Tighten it up. Let's put it over the Weber kettle. We're just gonna put it in like this. Boom. Flip the little unit on. Look at that. Just that simple, guys. These things are gonna cook down, and then we're gonna make a marinade. The marinade is next. Let's start. Our marinade calls for a cup of peach preserves. We're using Blackburn's peach preserves. What I like about this, I can use it as a glass for a beer later. So we're gonna use our pan that we had earlier because it's already got the EVOO in it. We're just gonna put the entire container or jar of peach preserves in it. Looks about perfect. Our recipe calls for about a tablespoon brown sugar, two chipotles in adobo sauce, One and two, I'm gonna give it a little more. I do like chipotles. Four tablespoons of chipotle sauce. We're just gonna eyeball it. Oh, another one down. One tablespoon of honey. Come on, honey. One teaspoon of apple cider vinegar. Good enough salt. Now the recipe does say to taste, but whatever that means, I'm not even sure what that means. A little pepper. To taste, of course. And mix all this in together as best we can. Try to keep as much in the cast iron pan as possible. Alright, now it's time to cook it down. 
To cook down our peach preserve sauce that goes on the wings, I'm just going to put it here on the very top of the Santa Maria style grill because I'm, you know, the chicken's going to take a while to cook. So I'm going to make make it so this takes a while to cook as well. All right, let's start. We've hit that point in our cook where the chicken is sitting at about 150 each. Give or take a little bit. I'm just gonna add a little adobo. Chicken has been on for about an hour and unfortunately the temperature has stalled out. So we're gonna fix that real quick like. Take these off. Looking beautiful. Lower this down. Move this off to the side. And just take our chicken off, right? Piece of cake. Put it directly over the coals. Move them around a little bit. Perfect. Now we did have one fallen soldier earlier. And we cooked that one caveman style for you. Patrick, that's yours, so when you come over, that's all for you. Our chicken stalled out a little bit ago, so we took it off the rotisserie thing. But this does give us a little bit of a chance to add some sauce to it. We don't really need a lot, but putting it over the direct heat will allow it to cook faster. It's time for our wings to come off. They've only been on for about 10 minutes over this. Looking great. I'm gonna add a little bit of our peach preserve marinade to it, sauce, whatever you want to call it. Mmm. I think it's time to try these. I got my paper towel. I got everything still on here. I do want to say we use an Uncle Steve's competition bird powder on these. Let's give it a shot. Mm. Very good. Wow. You get a little bit of bite from the chipotle pepper and the adobo sauce, but the preserves just really mellow this out. Same with, you know, we had added the honey and we added the, the brown sugar to it. Really just mellows these things out. Great flavor. Man almighty, they got great flavor. You got some crisp on that skin, but not a lot. Pretty much the way a wing should be. All right, you saw how we made it. You saw the ingredients we put in it. The recipe will be down below. I want to thank everybody for watching. If you get a chance, try these wings because there's some heat to it and some sweet. Heat and sweet, I like it. All right, we'll talk to you later, guys. Remember, stay safe out there, everybody. We'll talk to you soon. Take care.